Imagine having the power to automate your entire workflow completely for free. All of this thanks to an open source tool that puts over 1,000 integrations at your fingertips. Today, we're going to be showing you exactly how to get started with NAN, explaining everything you need to know about it, and how to get access to it completely for free. So first things first, let's start by explaining what NAN is in the first place. It's a versatile workflow automation tool that supports over 1,000 integrations and offers both no-code and low-code options. You'll learn how the free community edition allows you to build and run custom automations while keeping full control over your data through self-hosting. We'll also cover practical steps on how to set up N8N on a budget, including using a cost-effective VPS from providers like Hostinger. Along the way, we'll highlight some of its standout features such as AI integration through LangChain and the flexibility to customize workflows with JavaScript and Python. N8N is an open source workflow automation platform that's distributed under the sustainable use license, meaning you get full full access to its source code without any licensing fees or the community edition. This gives you the freedom to customize and extend its capabilities to suit your unique needs. Whether you're looking to connect your favorite apps, build custom automations, or even experiment with artificial intelligence workflows, N8N is designed to handle all of this. Because N8N is open source, many users choose to self-host on it, which not only gives you complete control over your data, but also dramatically reduces your operational costs. One popular approach is to deploy N8N on a low-cost VPS, like those offered by Hostinger, which you can check out using the link down in the description. We'll also give you a step-by-step -step walkthrough in this video, so make sure to stick around for that. Now, this self-hosting setup means that you can leverage enterprise-grade features like over 1,000 integrations, a robust visual editor for building workflows, and support for both no-code and low-code customizations. All of this without any recurring fees from N8N itself. In short, the context here is all about unlocking the full potential of an industry leading automation tool without spending a cent on software licenses and instead investing that on more reliable, cost-effective hosting. Now, while NADN's community is completely free to use, there are a few considerations to keep in mind before you get started with it. First, since you're opting to self-host on NADN, you'll be responsible for server management. This includes regular updates, security patches, and troubleshooting. This means you'll need a basic understanding of server administration as well as their Docker, and especially if you're doing and deploying it on a VPS. Another important important point is that although N8N offers over 1,000 integrations and immersive AI capabilities, its free version might have some limitations in terms of concurrent workflow executions as log retention compared to the paid plans. If you find that your automation needs start to grow significantly, you might eventually need to consider upgrading to one of their paid plans in order to handle higher volumes or receive dedicated support. And finally, while it does give you full control to customize your data and the ability to customize your workflows, this also means that you won't have the same level of customer support that comes with the paid tiers. You'll rely mostly on probably community forums or even maybe chat GBT if you need to solve issues. But with that out of the way, let's get your N8N up and running completely for free. First, we're going to be focusing on deploying it on a low cost VPS, which we're going to get through Hostinger. Make sure to follow along with me in these next steps of this video, because if you mess any of this up, you could make yourself vulnerable to hackers or potentially malicious malware. So it's important that you follow my steps exactly so that we don't make any mistakes here. The first thing you want to do is head down to the link down in the description for Hostinger. Once you click that link, you'll be brought to their specific N8N VPS hosting page where you're going to get up to 67% off the hosting plan that you end up choosing. As you can see, we're going to quickly choose this choose your plan button here. And I also want to add too that this Hostinger plan will come with a 30 day money back guarantee, which means of course that if you have any issues with the software or the platform, you can get your money back for your hosting plan with no issues. As you can see here, they have a ton of different plans you can choose from. And just breaking these down very simply, very easy for you to understand. You more want to probably go with one of the higher tier options if you're somebody who has a ton of automations and you have a really big automation system that you're building. If you're somebody who has very little experience with this and you're just kind of trying to dip your toes in and get a good understanding of how this all works in the first place, I would highly, highly recommend going with something like the KVM1 plan or the KVM2 plan. These are going to be more than enough for your beginner level needs and it's going to still let you play around with all the different automations for a fraction of the cost that it would be to actually host it on a professional server. Now, for the sake of this video, I'm going to just go with their KVM2 plan and I'm going to hit the choose the plan button. Once I hit the choose plan button, it'll then take me to the checkout page. And this is even more important, guys. I said that in this video, we could get 70% off. You can get even more if you type in the coupon code, my first website, all capitals, no spaces, and then hit the apply button. Once you do that, it'll add a 10% discount to your overall plan, getting you an even better deal in the process. You'll have the continue button here, fill out your billing information, and just like normal, you'll be ready to get started with 
Hostinger. Now, once you get inside of Hostinger and your VPS system is ready to go, the first thing you're gonna wanna do is set up the actual hosting plan in the first place. As you can see, this is what you might see when you first log into Hostinger, and this is called Hostinger's H panel. It's basically like their dashboard, and it's where you're gonna be spending most of your time when you're trying to go to the homepage. The next step here is setting up our VPS hosting. So let's go about doing that. You're gonna go to this left-hand sidebar here and click on the VPS option. Once you click on the VPS option, this is here right now because I'm showing it to you in the video, but you're gonna wanna go up to the top and either click on the get new VPS and Hostinger will then walk you through a step-by-step -step guide on setting up your hosting VPS. And the only thing you have to make sure you do here is select the N8N template. Once you select that template, it will walk you through setting up this entire process. And then at the very end, it should look something like this. The next thing we're gonna wanna do is hit the manage button or hit these three dots here and go to our settings. We'll go ahead and hit the manage button, which will then take us into our overview and show us all of our settings. Now these you don't have to worry about and trust me, I know this looks complicated, but it really isn't that complicated when I show you actually how this works in the first place. The next big step here is gonna be clicking on the manage app button. We'll click on the manage app button, which will then take us into a sign in page or a get started page with N8N. You'll create a quick account with an email, password, and then just like that, you're inside of N8N. Now, one of the coolest parts about N8N, and I just wanna show you how this works before we get into the actual hosting part of this, is that they actually have a template feature. If you look here, they have over 1,419 workflow automation templates that you can start using immediately without having to know how to do any of this yourself. That means no building on your part, no having to make any weird changes, no having to understand exactly how the software works. You can simply plug and play these templates into the software and it just works. So for a great example for this, let's say I want a marketing automation. So I'm gonna look and see what they have here. We have an AI powered social media content generator, an automated content generation WordPress, published WordPress posts, unlimited AI chat, uh, and so on and so forth. Now for the sake of this video, I wanna set up a relatively simple automation. So we're just gonna go to this upload Instagram and TikTok from a Google Drive folder. As you can see, I can use this workflow completely for free. I'm gonna click on the use for free, and then I just have to import this template to my self-hosted instance. I'll click on the import button, which will then import this automation directly into my N8N account. As you can see, the only things we have to do here is create a Google Drive credential, so that way we can have access to our Google Drive account, create an open AI credential to access to our open AI account, a Telegram account, and so on and so forth. And just like that, as you can see here, we have the full automation officially inside of N8N. Now, one of the things you might think immediately, especially if you have experience with automation, is that this looks a lot like Zapier. And I'm here to tell you that it is very similar to that, and it's very easy to utilize. You can pretty much just zoom in here by either clicking on the plus button on your keyboard or simply by zooming in with this little icon down here. As you can see, we have to set up all these different triggers here, and it shows you the exact path that the automation takes to get your entire automation running in the first place. There's also a short description here that gives you a full detail on how to get this going and how to properly use this automation in the first place. We can make changes to any of this too if we have any desires, and if we want to add anything, we can basically just go up to the top left here, click this plus button here, click on the workflow button, and it really is that easy. Now, if we want to start completely from scratch, we can do that too by going to the overview menu, going to one of our workflows, which again, you can rename it to anything you might want to do. So I'll just call this my test workflow. And then I can hit this plus button here to add my very first step. As you can see from this right side menu here, there's so many different steps that we can choose from. You can also think of just about any type of actual platform or software that you want to connect this service to. And there's pretty much a way to connect that, whether that's Google Ads, Google Chat, Google Docs, and of course, so many other platforms that you can look for. You can start building out these automations and really automate almost anything you can think of. Once you're all done with that, you can also share these. And if you want to actually turn on this actual automation in the first place, go up to the top here and then click on this little toggle that says an active. When you toggle that on, it will say active and you can start using the automation and the automation will start executing. And as you can see, if we go over to the settings in the usage and plan category, we are currently on the community edition. This means that this is free forever. We never have to pay anything for this software and we get access to over a thousand plus different automations that we can use without having to worry about ever paying any recurring fees. The biggest step here is getting started with Hostinger like I showed you at the beginning of the video. So once again, make sure you use that link down in the description to not only get 67% off your VPS hosting plan, but also use the code my first website, all capitals, no spaces at checkout for an even greater discount. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment down in the comment section if you guys have any questions about how this setup process works. I'd be more than happy to answer them. Also make sure to leave a like if you enjoy the video and subscribe so you don't miss any of our future videos. Other than that though, I'll see you guys in the next one.